like an alpine skiing safety net, which did its job. It catches Hunter Lawrence, but damage done as he now slides back from third to fifth. <laughs> the gap on Nodden. He's been in the top five for the majority of this photo, Brian, looking for some decent lines through this big sweeper section. Oh, my! Did he get a wrong through there? Big high side. Oh, and Philip Hodel's down. Yeah, he goes up the inside, but he has to check up a bit because Nodden cuts him oh. off, and he gets into some soft stuff. Oh. Classic high side oh. body slam. Wow, that has to hurt. What a brutal crash for Philip Hodel. Talking to him earlier, he's just enamored with his new team and his new bike. Here it is, comes up a bit short, coming into the international section, just buckles and rag dolls himself. Yep. Celebrity come dancing, folks. Nichols. Oh, Martin, oh. down he goes. Martin yep. got all out of shape, Ricky, and he couldn't catch him. Yeah, he sure did. He came into the whoops so fast, and what happened was he missed one. See how he's, he missed ooh, one, and the beat came up the bags at that point. Ooh. Yeah, he, he took a pretty good there. hit right there to his head, but he, he lost his grip. Watch his right hand come off the bars right here. Well, wonder what happens with this. Oh. Cirulo. <laughs> yep, lines come together. Oof. Oh, and he lands on Ouch. the brake. On, land on that front brake caliper on his back. A week ago in Minneapolis. Oh! Taking the big tumble just in front of Martin is Moseman. With Michael Craig, number 19, and Damon Huffman, right there, number 12. And Huffman lost it in spectacular style. It kind of stopped the hearts of his fans and friends as his bike went spiraling through the air. That was pretty scary. He lost the handlebars, and the last thing he let go of was the throttle. Which, after Jeremy Seawood, will be Tim Geiser. Oh! Big, big moment there for uh, Jeremy Seawood. Wondered where that came from. Oh, this will be a decent angle. Look at that. How do you think the tracks will be? I remember Eli oh, and talking earlier about oh, it's sticky as Oh! Hard. Cooper Webb gets clipped from behind! Sexton oh. gets it from behind! And look at the damage done on Chase Sexton! Oh, Cooper Webb. Pace the jump, pace the double. There is oh. nowhere for Chase Sexton to go. And he just jumped right on the top of Cooper Webb. See, he goes to triple. No one's tripled that. He was... Oh. He, what, right yeah, here. Yeah, and then right here, watch it. Chase Sexton, boom. There was nowhere for Chase to go. That is not Chase's fault. He was wrong place at wrong time. What a boost this would be if Adam Cicero could hold on to this, Todd. We know the struggles that he's had coming back from injury, and I was told as he battles there with Cooper. Oh, oh no! Oh. AC gets bucked off that Kawasaki back on his feet. Uppercut from the handlebars. Oh. He gets in there. Cooper, he's starting to feel Cooper, but... Loses the rear. Once that thing is going, he's for a passenger. Blew his boots open. That's how bad it was. So, but right here. Wow. Oh, wow. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Supercross. Yeah. That, these guys are so tough. Speeds are fast. Oh, he looks super fast. And yes, slow all at once. Here we go. Oh, oh, oh my. Oh, oh my. That just shows oh. you the danger of that quad double behind the start line. He is slow getting up. Definitely oh. charged. Come on, Simon. Oh, man, I don't think he's going to salvage any points this photo after riding so brilliantly earlier on. A new line through the wolves. They were faster, but putting way wide for this double. And he's not going to be in fact, He missed the double completely. Oh, no, Mike Clay jumped right on top of Denny Stevenson. I can't believe Stevenson's getting up. Let's take another look at that. Stevenson was taken wide by Emmick Bang. He got the front end nose first, lost the handlebars. Craig is already committed, and Bang just missed his head from the way Stevenson reacts. I think he took most of that impact on his right arm. Oh! Liam Evans over the bars. Down. Just catches that hole. Oh. He right at number 230. That's Brooks Kudrowski, number four. Now watch what happens to Brooks all by himself. He goes down. Guy Cooper jumps on top of him. Oregon almost hits Brooks on one side. He jumps and he almost gets nailed again. But watch what happens. Brooks is down. Cooper just smashes into the motorcycle. He goes off to the side, lands right in the mechanics area. And uh, he jumps up, holding his wrist. 
Look at what happens here. He just over jumps. Whoa! Oh! Ho, ho, ho. What? A, look at him holding on to the fence. He landed and kind of fell off the back of the bike. The suspension rebounded, and he was a passenger. Good inside line. Oh! oh. Riders piling up on the side. Three, four riders collected. Yeah, that was, let's see here, Mitchell Harrison and Jordan Smith collide in midair. Here we go. Look at to the right-hand side of your screen, number 80 and 35. 80 tangles with the number 72 of Cody Shock, and there was nowhere Mitchell Harrison could go. March Banks getting tangled up. That is just a racing incident. Yeah, the 80 of George Smith, he collides with the 35, and yeah, that was a tough hit. Hey guys, we're seeing the aftermath of this down.